Hey guys, it's me, Christina Marie. So I'm gonna show you guys an alternative to ice cream that's extremely healthy. And I think any kid would like it just because it looks really cool. So I'm gonna make you guys some all natural popsicles today. And I'm also gonna show you guys a little makeup tip doing this cooking video or this video. I guess I'm not cooking, I'm just creating. So anyways, okay, let's get started. Um, so I bought all these different kinds of fruits. This is fresh. You can do fresh or frozen for this recipe. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna get a bunch of different fruits that you like. We'll put this down so you guys can see what I'm doing. Yeah, right here. Okay, so, and then you're gonna get these popsicle containers. If you don't have the popsicle containers, you can always get like a Dixie cup and put a stick in it. Um, but these popsicle containers you can get at the dollar store. I got these ones at Walmart for three bucks. Okay, so what you're gonna do, and I've already kind of started, you're gonna take the fruit, any type of fruit that you want, and you're gonna you're gonna put it in the cup, right? I'm gonna do this one, an orange strawberry. So we're gonna get the fruit, and remember, it's best if your fruit is. Um, you see this? Let me see. Make sure you guys can see this. It's best if your fruit is thawed. So this is an orange strawberry. What you want to do when you do these fruit pops, you want to make sure that you squish all the fruit down there so that the uh, popsicle is nice and compacted. Well, actually, we want to leave a little bit of room for, um, that one's gonna be mine. <laughs> a little bit of room for the juice that's gonna go into it. Okay, so, you know, like you can mix and match all different types of flavors. You guys know that berries are extremely healthy for you guys. So I'm gonna put some, some raspberries and some blueberries. Now these ones, no, you guys probably want to see. These are the dark sweet cherries. They're pitted already. You know, cherries are just awesome antioxidants for you, you know. So, okay, so check it out. When you stuff them, you take any type of fruit juice that you want. I'm actually going to take a homemade, um, this is a limeade I made, and you're gonna fill each cup up. Okay, so you're gonna fill each cup up. And this is the reason that I said that it has to be uh, defrosted because this is not defrosted and my stick won't go through. Now this one was defrosted and my stick will go through. I already have some that I already did over here. You guys can see what they look like. Let me pick up the camera so you guys can check it out. You see that? And when you pull them out, that's exactly how they look. Isn't that so cool? Okay, so you guys want to know the beauty <laughs> beauty secret? Okay, let's check. Let's, let me show you. This is dark sweet cherries. This is blueberries. Okay, did you also know that? Let's do the cherry today. That these here are. And you guys have to excuse the mess. It's like totally messy. Um, these here are natural lip stains. So let me get close. You guys can see this. You see that? So what you do is you rub it. You can do this with a blueberry, a frozen blueberry, or a frozen cherry or a beet, you work it in, let it dry, and do it again. See? And then you can eat it. So I hope you guys enjoyed my little beauty tip and my um, popsicle tutorial. If you have any comments, post it on my Facebook or YouTube. I'll put the links down below. I'm Christian Emery. I'm out, bye.